Oh, hello. And we have a very special treat for you today. Cuddles and Bubbles. Uh, two Pomeranian puppies. Tiny little things. They are just 14 weeks old. And they're all over the place and obviously do not listen. So together with their social skills, they will be learning some of the manners and their listening comprehension over the next few sessions with us. So to start with, you can see, being puppies, they eat. This is what puppies do. Whenever food is available, cuddles, bubbles. Oh, they will be right there receiving food. So when the owners suggest that their dog is not into food or not food motivated, it's the owners. It's never, and I mean never, dogs. So at this stage, it's fairly simple. Now, today we're covering several issues. Well, to start with, is just follow me, begin to listen, stick around, pay attention. Well, basically everything that good attitude should entail. Now I'm feeding them from one pot. There are loads and loads of tiny little kibbles there, so I will be able to safely reward them over 100 times each without overfeeding. It's just their lunch allowance. Now they both have never been on the lead and we want to introduce the leads nicely and safely. Now doing anything with two dogs is a big job. A big, well, impossible job. So to start with, Cuddles will have to sit this one out. So we have a safe leash to put her on. So we will take turns and do it with one dog at a time. They both respond in a pretty similar way when it comes to behavior on the lead. So let's say we want to go that way and the dog would naturally object to it. These are what dogs are like. They're conservative. If they've never had it on, they wouldn't know how to behave with it. And naturally they will try to protest. So the rule number one will be this, slack lead. So instead of the tight, you know, and the lead with the pressure on, I will be using the lead either slack or just getting them used to having the lead pretty much just lagging there behind them, getting them used to the sensation and the smell and the occasional tiny little pressure, leash reward. So once again, lead, reward, and so on. All right, bubbles. All right. Now, with all our traditional exercises, such as this way, that way, going into a little twirls, <laughs> we can do that already. Good. Well done. I will try and use the leash. So as I said, little pressure is no pressure, so they will be getting used to following me, even though the lead is on. I love that. That's very good. Excellent. Very good job. So imagine I was walking and not just moving my hand from left to right. And the dog will be following me with the lead being slack. So having the lead on is not a big thing. All right, we want it to end as a positive experience, so naturally the puppy is a bit worried. Well, anyway, few sessions later, I bet it will be a very, very different picture. Good, well done. So yes, I know, I can reward you just for being quiet and patient and waiting for your turn. Okay. Right, they will eventually have to do it together, but to start with, we want a strong foundation in each dog. So right, now I will very quickly swap them over. Right, as a starter sessions, we don't need to hit hundreds and thousands of repeats. We want to go with just a few of those. Imagine it's been this many three times a day. That's still gonna be lots more than not doing any. Oh, very clever, very clever. All right, so this is Cuddles. So as I said, at this stage, it's very hard to tell them apart. They will both follow the hand quite willingly, but with no determination and no solid understanding of what it is they're supposed to do. So obviously we could be using one of those leads or there's another answer. How do you get the dog to walk on the lead without pulling? Just have the lead that is pointless to pull. This one is a 30 foot long lead. So I can just let it trail. We can start going to a park and walking very safely, getting the dog used to a weight of the lead, to being in a safe environment. Just like running inside a tennis court, which you cannot escape. Well, basically taking the tennis court with you wherever you go. 
Right, hey, come on Cuddles. Yes, I know the food is somewhere there and you're not used to be eating by from hand just yet, but you will be. It's right there. Uh, can you see that this is your starting point where the dogs don't know what to watch? Good girl. Well done, Bubbles. Let's see here. Good. Cuddles. Say, I'm not sure I'm Cuddles. Usually. Hey. Good. Well done. We will have to spend a little bit of time with each one of them. So if they're not responding very well, good. We'll just have to be patient and repeat it over and over and over again. They will be learning lots of other skills, just like being handled, being told what to do, ordered from left to right, and from a sit into the down. Now, now, can you say that now she's behaving so well being on the lead? Yeah, kind of. But this on the lead, kind of a lead, creates the off lead environment where the dog can start learning how to be on the lead at a nice, soft, gentle lead. All right, Carlos and Bubbles, you've done extremely well today. Right, obviously each session with me would take a little longer, but we'll be on and on, and I hope the owners will back me up in this game. Good dog, very good. Cuddles, this way, good. Well done, Bubbles. And sit. Good. Before I expect them both to do it next to one another, they both have to be really strongly queued up on what to do and what not to do. So there are about three dozens of biscuits left. So we'll very quickly go through the remainder of the exercises. Start applying pressure on the lead. Introduce the name. Cuddles. Good girl. Cuddles, well done. Even eating from the hand is not automatic yet. She's still looking for biscuit, not being sure where, to, where exactly to get it. Cuddles, good girl. Lead, well done. Cuddles, come on this, go this way. Hey, hey, oh yes, okay, I'm not making it easy, am I? Cuddles, this way. Good girl. Well done, and a little pressure. Cuddles, this way. Good girl. The idea is that very soon an empty hand will cause them to do the exact same thing. Cuddles, this way. Hey. This way, cuddles. Oh, that will do just beautifully. Well done, Bubbles. Good. Cuddles, girl. Good. Good. Sit. Excellent job. Sit. Nice. Nice. Good girl. And this way. And this way. Excellent. Well done. So I'm keeping an eye on keeping the amount of food pretty for pretty equal. There's nothing there. Yes, I wanted to be sure about that. Here is a leash. Alright, Carlos. Come. Oh yes, it is better to come to me. I found a big here on the way. And the last one to go. Sit. Bubbles. Cuddles, well done girls. Thank you very much guys. We'll see their progress very soon. Bye.